Hello everybody, welcome to Chaos Control, where I review bad video games. So today we're going to be taking a look at possibly the worst video game, or the worst Mortal Kombat game ever created by Warner Brothers. It's um, Mortal Kombat Mythology Sub-Zero. Now, this game has a 37% metric rating, which is pretty much, which is essentially the Rotten Tomatoes of video games. Uh, it has been heralded as one of the possibly the worst Mortal Kombat game, if not the worst fighting game ever created. Well, at least licensed by a major company, as that is. Um, so, this game was pretty hard to find, let me tell you this. I had to pay someone on eBay 20 bucks just to find it. There are two uh, small little video game stores in North Carolina near Caldwell and Catawba. Uh, That's Infinity Gaming and Red Fox Gaming, and neither one had the game. So I had to pick it up online. It took a few days to get here, but at least I got it, especially with this whole pandemic going on. So, uh, let's see uh, how bad this game really is. Alright, I am now loading the game up. So, so, so far everything seems okay, but of course I have not gotten to the game yet. This is all the titles and etc. So it honestly seems like we start off the game with a definition of mythology. A body of collective myths and I don't even get a chance to read it, I guess. Let's just turn that up. Whoops, I didn't even mean to skip that. That was my bad. So here's the title screen, yes. As you do, of course, you have to use the dialogue stick, not the dialogue stick, but the dialogue buttons. Let's take a look at the options. Controller configuration, you know, just your basic stuff for the PlayStation 1. Mortal Kombat 4 preview. It's just basic stuff. Now let's start the game. Let's just see how bad this game really is. Steal the sacred map of the elements. What if I don't want to steal anything? Why the hell do I gotta steal something? That's fucking stupid. Okay, we're fighting, um, good old... Okay, so pretty- okay, so I've seen some complaints about this. You're pressing the, uh, the right trigger for Xbox players, I guess you could call it, to, like, turn around and all that, but it's in like, oh my god, the character is slow. Okay, that's- okay. No, nothing seems too out of the ordinary just yet, and we walk through a door. Yes, my favorite part of- Oh, my favorite part of playing Mortal Kombat. Oh, look at that. Now, I am one of the Mortal Kombat players. Where the fuck's the Toasty at? Toasty, where the fuck is that at? He's like, oh... Nobody's gonna buy this shitty game, so let's not put Toasty in the game. Alright, let's just, uh, no Toasty, that's fine, that's fine. Oh boy, um, I think I've just committed a murder. Oh, that's not good. What's this? What's that? Oh, I don't know what I got, but okay. I guess that works, I guess. Really? You're not you're not gonna give me any sort of warning, you're just gonna Boulder! Oh shit! That's it? Just just gonna Just gonna have me just die like that? Just no warning, just no warning! No, these gamers They they know what they're doing, just kill them right off the gate. No no warning, just a giant fucking giant fucking boulder Yeah? Giant boulder, ladies and gentlemen. 
This is clearly the best of video games that I have ever played. Literally. It beats fucking Doki Doki. It beats Kingdom Hearts. It even beats the best Mortal Kombat game in my opinion, Mortal Kombat 9. Just opinion though, Mortal Kombat 1011, right up there of course. But you didn't even give us a fucking chance. I just walked, there was no sign. There was nothing that said, watch out for boulders. Nothing. It just fucking slammed a boulder right on you. There was nothing. At least warn the player that yes, there are obstacles in this game. Don't fucking throw us into the game. Expect us to know what to do. Don't give us dialogue. Don't give us any text. D don't... You don't do that. You just throw us into this game thinking we know what the hell to do. Nothing, like Mortal Kombat is not a side-scroller. It is not. And that's what essentially this game is, minus the side-scrolling. The map fucking moves as you walk. Okay? And you have essentially made Mario Kart for gory, loving adults. That's essentially what you've made. But not even that good. If you needed that help, you should have said, Hey Nintendo, will you help us? I'm sure they would have given you a few pointers. I'm sure, if that's what you were going for. First you show us Scorpion. Okay, it's understandable. But no dialogue, it's like... That's it. He just ran off. That's all it was. And then you walk through. Okay. Your first enemy, that's fine. They stand there, that gets you, that's good. You let your player get to know the mechanics and everything. No toasty, by the way. That pisses me off. Also, and then back to the boulder. You just keep walking. There's nothing telling you. Hey, watch out, boulder. Just boulder. That's not how you make a fucking game for beginner players. You should, I don't even, not even beginner players. Players in general. That is not how you do that. Well, back to the game, I guess. So they restart you from the very beginning. And guess, and yeah, like, these fucking controls are not... I mean, for PlayStation 1, I guess they're fine, but I, that's... So, so we go through the door again, as per usual. Oh. There. I just button mashed him. Apparently, we were supposed to get crushed by the boulder, as... Yes, we were supposed to get crushed by the boulder, ladies and gentlemen. I just threw him. I just need him in the dick and he disappeared. Holy shit. Is there... Is, is, is... You see that? Like, look at that. It clearly says, climb me. Oh, okay. I will not lie. I will not lie. I do enjoy the whole early aesthetic of Mortal Kombat that they're using here. Where they got like, it looks like, you know, they have a render of an actual person in a costume. That looks good. It would not work nowadays, but back then with the whole pixelation, it did work. And I'm just gonna say, I do enjoy that a lot. Okay, back to the game. Oh yes, I forgot. We must press the right trigger to even do anything. And I... I... There, yeah, okay guys, there is something right... See? See, like, you have... So... It seems like... No matter what you do... You're gonna die! So, here's what you gotta do. You gotta walk... Like, you can stand there for a bit. I stand there for a bit. I should have dropped by then. Like, okay, I guess I gotta walk closer. I walk closer, I get damaged. Fine! Then it goes back up, and the same amount of time that I wait as I'm trying to cross, it slams down on me. That makes super duper sense. Doesn't it? It d d does to me. I mean, the game is practically the best game in the world. Shit, Mario doesn't even... Like, this is high-level game design right here. I mean, come on, this shit passed through Warner Brothers? Who gave them this idea? Now, apparently there were supposed to be multiple mythology games, but this game was so bad that 
they decided, nope, no more mythology games. So, sorry, we had, no, no more, no more. Stop, stop with the mythology games. No more. I'm just, I'm just like, come on, guys. This is literally, come on, Warner Brothers. This pat, I, I don't know who decided this would be a good idea. Like, hey, what would be the, a great first obstacle? A boulder that always kills you? Good idea, Jimmy. That's probably why we don't have fucking Shaggy in Mortal Kombat 11. Now they're sending me back to the beginning. Now, I'm giving this game many chances. Hopefully, this is all part of the story that you die many times. Endless death. I'm Come on, guys. Give the... Get, tell me that you're actually, you know saying, giving me a story. Oh yes, I forgot. You can't turn by yourself. Yes, I punched him in the air and killed him. That makes sense. Kicked him in the dick. Perfect. Good. Must turn around by pressing the right trigger. Hey, did I forget to mention how great this game is? Okay, back to the game. And we're almost, and we're at low health. Um. We died. Now that was my fault. That was my fault. Now let's continue. Let's continue, of course. Yes, we shall now jump continuously. This is a very fast way of getting through this, by the way. Just continuously. Throw him. They turn the mush, by the way. They, they literally do turn the mush. Now, now, now guys, if it looks like that it's taking a very long time for the character to move, that's not my problem. That's the games. It look like the movement feels kind of clunky at times. Like you move fine. It's like very somewhat smooth. Sometimes when you're fighting, like the punches don't hit at the right time. But Chaos, it's a PS1 game. Street Fighter. The other Mortal Kombat games on the PlayStation 1 all play better than this game when it comes to fighting. Guarantee it. There's a reason why there wasn't any more mythology games. Okay, making our way down to this tunnel yet again. I swear, these have to do something. I can't be crazy. These have to do something. Besides, you know, distract me from a fight. I could literally just stand here and just... I can literally just stand here and do this. That's all I gotta do. And if he gets lucky, if I don't get him in a massive combo and he doesn't back away, I can just keep spamming the triangle button because that's all I gotta do. That's all you gotta do. That's all I gotta do is stand there and button bash the freaking triangle button. This is a great game. I mean, check this out. Oh, he dies before I even get a chance to show you. Lord, how mercy. Again, this has to do something, right? This this, this has to do something, right? I, I can't be crazy. There it is again. I You don't even get a fucking chance, guy. Like, literally, this game is just... What? What? <sighs> Maybe I'm not getting it. Let me, let me play through it a little bit more. So I did find something. Apparently there are hidden obstacles and things that you can't get past in this game. Thank you, IGN. And apparently there are secret ways to get past. And now I'm just thinking to myself, okay, that is great information, but how the hell do I do that? I've been trying... For 30 minutes already, and it is not... 
Like, okay, is can I just grab something? Can I can I do anything in this anything at all? Like anything will work. Anything. Something tells me they're not gonna tell me how to get past this, are they? Great, let's just continue through this shitty game. There's got to be something. There's got to be, right? Now, I have said many times... There's this guy here, I'm sure... Maybe I just go to attack multiple of them? Oh my god, I can't even... Also, we've got herbs in this game. Yes, herbs. And uh, it's not even... Good, we just killed someone. We probably killed an innocent man. That man probably had a family. He was only doing this because he needed money. We just killed that man dead. And now, okay, back to the whole... Okay. Okay, so if you, like, this is an instant death. That's instant death right there. So, there's got to be another way. Maybe if we go backtrack, but that's just terrible game design. They, they wouldn't, well, this is new, a third, a fourth man. This has never happened before, um, us unveiling a fourth man. This is new. A fourth man. Are we going to get a fifth man? Is that some, like, plus, the background doesn't even look cool. I mean, for Mortal Kombat, at least. I know the whole dark and gritty thing was their thing, but at least Mortal Kombat 1 and 2, and even the third one, they all had cool backgrounds for the whole setting they were trying to reimagine, I guess you could say. This one is just bland, I guess you could say. There is some artwork, but it's just not... It's the same picture. The same damn picture. Now, you can just, you can ma so you're supposed to select objects with the good old uh, L1 button, as I like to call it. You just, you can even make more, you can even make some zero dance. And the left trigger doesn't even do anything. You've got to, you, come on, you've got to jump up here. There ain't no freaking way you're not supposed to jump up here. Ain't no freaking how. So, what you're telling me is, is there's no way to get through? Yeah, that makes sense. So, I died. You know what I do with this game? Do you want to know what I'm gonna about to do to this game? Me and you are about to go on a fucking journey. We're about to go on a journey. I'm just gonna fucking stick it back in the fucking package it came in. Very fucking go. I'm about to fucking go on a journey with me. <sighs> it's hot. It's hot out here. Uh, we're about to go. We're going to take a little walk. About to fucking show this game what's up. <sighs> show you what I'm about to do this game. Well, you piece of shit game. This is goodbye. Fuck you, game.